Yeah, I'm, I'm done. I don't want to be brainwashed. Hey guys, we're coming to Poland. Yes, the Poles come. Yes, we do. So, we're actually going to Poland in two days for a concert next, next week. Next week? What day is it? The, the 21st of December. We decided we would put familiar. For, but familiarize ourselves with some Polish music. Now, obviously, when we think Polish music, we think of Chopin and Wienowski, but that's not all the Polish music actually out there. So, we decided to discover some more lesser known but equally interesting and talented Polish music out there. Chopin. Need to go on a Wienowski. Get it? Uh, Wienowski. <coughs> the first one is ignorant. I said I thought I said pregnancy. Pregnancy Jan Pedorowski. Many went G. Many went G G. Game over. What if it's a broken lance or something? That's fine. I can't hear anything. That's good. I can't hear anything. I can't hear anything. I'm just I'm just messing with you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's nice music. I was just pranking Eric. It sounds very classical. But it was composed in 1921. This guy's like old school. He's like a hipster. He's like, you know what, I'm not gonna go mainstream like Debussy and Ravel. Yeah, screw all that going towards a tonal. He went the other way. Yeah, I'm going back to Mozart. Went back to old school OG roots. Oh my god. This is really intense. I don't know why if it reminds you of like music from like an AMV exam. It does. Yeah, it's, no, like, it's like, like an AMV or it's an Australian music examination board or Trinity College or yeah, Royal, yeah, yeah. Royal, uh, Royal. Uh, ABRSM, you know. Yeah. Those exams. Yeah. It's like grade six or seven, you know. What or grade eight. do you think this would be? You play piano before. Yeah. Six. I reckon it'd be grade six. Okay, yeah. next one. Next is a guy called Grishna Basiwaz. Grajina very rich. That's what it sounds like when I try to play unison. Sounds like me when I'm tuning. It sounds like your first note for your brass concert. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's two classics. And you need to press 24, variation 2. If I want to listen to violence, sometimes you and I'll just look at the technique and yeah. all the music. Yeah. It's like, three cousins. I can't, I'm just focusing. Whoa, tuning! She is tuning. Next one, Lutowski. Now Lutowski. Yes. He's like a wartime composer. Yes. Like the end of World War Two. What? Dragon Henry Caprice Twenty Four. Where's the cop? The copyright exists back then. I don't know. I think our Jingle Bell version is better. Oh, my neck's so tight. Getting more atonal. Yeah. Ooh. Oh! That sounds like the Polish language. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. I'm joking. No, I was gonna buy a ticket. Yeah. <laughs> that will, please come to our show. Wow. Wow. That's cool. That's the octave one, so... So what is this? This is all going to the bottom right. Yeah. He's leaning over the first. Yeah. The rock concert. Look at this brass. And piano. Yeah. The soil is the orchestra first and the piano. 
I wanna get the thirds. Oh, you pussy it out. Easier. You pussy it out. It does it slowly. Da 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 da. She just do it like that. Da da da. Oh, it's a musical interpretation. Okay, next one. Panufnik and Zivzje. Panufnik. Sorry, cannot pronounce Polish stuff, but we'll get there by next week. Sounds like a Christmas horror movie. Yeah. Oh, this is nice. Do you guys want to hear a joke? Sure. What happens when there's two violists, same height, same weight, and they jump off the top floor when they land? That's really good. I don't know if you can build this music, but it's really good. <laughs> Where'd you get that one from? Someone told me. I think someone in Vienna <laughs> told me a joke. They just told me to make a video on build the jokes. Hey, I'm meant to be reacting to this. That is the reaction to this. <laughs> okay, next one. Was, was she killer? Right, so I've actually, we've heard this piece before. It's really cool piece. Well, this isn't a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love that it's a background. It might be. I think this is a place in Poland, so that might be a picture uh, of the place. Uh, killer. Okay, guys, tell us if that's true. But if, if it's not, just enjoy this beautiful scenery. scenery. Nice trees and clouds and. Okay. 2003 photo, yep. <laughs> Thanks. HD. It's a bit like, very repeated, like glass. It puts you in a trance. If you like it, keep listening to it. It's a very nice music. Next one, Henrik Gorecki. It's like Barbers, Dajo for Strings. This actually has a. I was looking at it before. There's a lot of views. Wow. I've never heard of it though. But I gotta look at it like this guy. Yes. Looks like the Da Vinci Code. What's that movie? Da Vinci Code? No, Hunger Games. Goes. I hate scores written like that. Oh. It's so hard to read the notes. It's like, is it a lollipop? Or on the right side, get your theory right. Next one. You'll like this next one though. Okay. Oh. Oh, what a. Oh my god. And the recce. You recce my ears. <laughs> There's a lot of sound attack to this, guys. Just letting you know. Yeah, like, oh, this is too much. So, um, where are earplugs to be sitting in front of Piccolo? Play this on your next romantic date. Oh, dude. The girl will love it. Yeah. She'll be like, I've always wanted to wonder what it feels like to wonder if I'm going to get killed tonight. Next. No, 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 no. I want to listen to it. Why? You gotta listen to this because it gets cool. You gotta like tap your phone. I gotta picture this, like, what's happening right now. This is. Everyone's running away. Do you know the heat was so instantaneous that when you go to Hiroshima today, you see shadows of people that were standing. You know what I mean? Oh, really? You see, because that person was standing there, yep. and they got incinerated, and everything got cast white, but there's a shadow where they stood, because that was like oh. blocking the explosion. That's messed up. Yeah, next one. Langodikolesani. Oh, Why is he shaking his legs? Shake his... That's what it feels like to be a classroom violent teacher, guys. Um, this gives 
Because what is he doing with the keys? He's like flapping his... Confirmed. Best carnets are the best lovers in town. What are they saying? This is like some chant. Please, can you comment if your Polish comment the translation below, please? Yeah, what are they saying? How do they keep their faces straight? I would lose my shit if I was there. This is Smashing's best carnet. Yeah. This is like some brainwashing cult. Okay, I'm, I'm done. I don't want to be brainwashed. If, if you set your kids to a music school and they're like, Daddy, this is what we did in class today, and they showed you, what would you do? I'd be like, son, are you alright? <laughs> did I do anything to you? Do you remember anything? Just kidding. In case it actually means something. Last one. Agata Zubel, Cascando. Oh. Looks like my nose. Oh, the sharp oh, my ears. It's meant to be a G natural. Oh, it's G sharp. No, the whole thing's a semitone sharp. Oh, what's that? A violin? Broke a violin string. Wow, well, I can't even tell. I see that. Yeah. Bro, I see the challenge. Follow the score. <laughs> Please, translations below, Polish people. I want dumplings. I want vodka. Pierogi. What are the food is? What's it called? Guys, I think that's enough for today. <laughs> um, if you liked any of the pieces that we uh, saw today, the links are in the description box below. Yeah. Listen to them, check them out, some of them are really cool. And comment on any other composers you think we should mm. listen to as well. Yeah. And then we'll have a look. Cool. And until then, if you're in Warsaw or in Poland, come check us out. We'll be there next Thursday. Get your tickets below in the comments and subscribe. Bye bye.